Hey guys, it's Matt. Welcome to Speed Tutor and welcome to the best free assets for January, February 2024. I feature some of the best 3D models, visual effects, editor extension and everything that you can find for free on the Unity Asset Store. This month has over 70 free assets and this selection that I'm going to show is more than normal because there's an awesome selection of really, really useful assets that I just need to show you. So make sure you watch all the way through to really save yourself time and do be sure to check out all the links in the description because there's a free asset that you can get for this week and Unity have a brand new mega bundle to make incredible savings on over 20 different assets. And do be sure to check out my Patreon too to get over 225 different scripts, assets and projects you cannot find anywhere else. So the first one we've got is the Fog of War and Field of View and this feature adds that RTS style Fog of War effect and this works over terrain with different elevations too so you can use it seamlessly throughout the different levels that you might have. The next one is the Monster Rake which is a monster character about 2500 polygons in a PBR style with 9 different animations ranging from running, walking, attacking and dying. The next useful one is something called Hue Folders. So this is a plugin which lets you highlight folders by giving them a gradient style colour which is really nice for keeping things organised and knowing exactly which folders for which rather than just seeing plain text. The next one is something called GI Light 2D so it's an experimental real-time 2D ray tracing feature specifically for URP and it works by rendering a layer mask and you can render this directly in the camera to a global texture and you can create really really nice looking global illumination effects in 2D. The next really usable one is something called the Custom Inspector. This asset is a full Custom Inspector solution which has over 51 different attributes, 150 code examples, full documentation to be able to create Custom Inspectors, buttons, titles, highlights without you having to write those yourself. Next one is the audio collection and with an audio manager template. So it includes 20 different scripts. So you can easily control music, ambience, it has on audio fading system, it has scriptable objects so you can add your own effects in there and loads of examples with audio showcases. Next one is the Ropofu foot placement IK for feet and knees, which can target a surface and make sure that your feet are always flat against it and make sure that it's a realistic looking simulation. Next one is the universal UI sound effects. So this is 180 UI sound effects. Great for anybody looking to do menus or other things like that. First one here is the distortion shockwaves visual effect, which allows you to create that shockwave that looks almost transparent with smooth blending and it's completely textureless and you can use that URP. Next one is the image flow, which is another processing effect for URP. So it's an old school effect with a render feature which adds displacement on rotation. It can be combined with other processing effects to create confusion or a strange flow in your style scene. Next one is from the same developer called Screen Outline and it allows you to filter by grayscale or depth and filter out contrast zones to create highlighting. Next one by the same developer again is Pixelation FX. So this is a full screen pixelation effect, which has a render and volume profile to set the screen to look like a grid. Next one is something similar to what I've featured before, and this is jump to favorites tool. So you might like to use assets and specific things in your project all of the time. This allows you to favorite those in a nice little inspector window. You can drag them straight in and use them whenever you need. We've got some particle effects now, which is the first one is the cinematic explosions free for URP, which are some really high quality, realistic looking effects with screen shake and really cool looking examples. Another set of high quality explosions, which is eight realistic effects, 8K textures, 64 frames of animation in each. Next really usable one is something called Compact Events, which allows you to take Unity's normal events. They use a lot of unneeded space and this allows you to collapse them down and really save space in the editor. So it's really something that Unity should implement themselves. Next one is the fancy mobile GUI pack for beginners. Simple pack with rounded rectangles, checkboxes, progress bars, toggle buttons, ribbons, overall with a cartoon, simple modern style. Next one is the simple pie menu free. Now this one is only free for a very short time. So you may or may not get this asset for free when I create this video, but this is a radial style menu, which you can use to rotate, scale and adjust the headers, choose animations to adjust the appearance and automatically hide and unhide when you need it, whether you need a weapon selection. Next one is the character pack free sample. This is a low poly male character which you can move around with 11 high quality custom animations 
and it's still very much supported on the Unity Asset Store. And last but not least is something called Plane Controller, which simulates realistic physics and aerodynamics. It's got intuitive controls, easy to integrate and customize with a package that's got full documentation. It's got existing examples and it's fully ready out of the box. I'll leave all the links to the free stuff and Unity's new mega bundle that's on the Asset Store now. And do be sure to check out my Patreon too to get over 225 different scripts, assets and projects you cannot find anywhere else. Big thank you to all my patrons, special thank you to Peter Steiner and everybody else who comes to watch the video. So don't forget to like, comment and subscribe. Cheers.